Hey guys, today I'm filming kind of a spontaneous video because I just got this package in the mail. I don't know if you can tell from the color of the box what this might be. Uh, can you guess now? <laughs> it is my friend here on YouTube, Samantha March, her little collab that she did with Ofra Cosmetics. So cute, she had been hinting about this for the last couple of, I feel like weeks actually, and then I knew it was a highlighter the way she kept talking about it, and then she also came out with like her favorite Ofra lipsticks. So I'm excited because I've been wanting to try Ofra's liquid lipsticks from the days since they like came out and then Kathleen Light did their collab and they came out with like all these cute lippies and everyone's always talked about how comfortable these are so I am so pumped and I am so excited for this color because this one looks right up my alley it's called Las Olas mm, you guys know I love a terracotta shade and I wanted to film this so that if you are tan skin and you weren't sure if these shades were gonna work for you I wanted to get this video up so you could see it on my complexion and then decide if you want to purchase obviously Samantha March is Caucasian so she isn't gonna be able to tell you like this is what it looks like on a tan person so I'm excited because I decided to take one for the team and then on the back here it has her handle and it says lip set go nude with Samantha March March Beauty Word favorite Ofra lippies in this curated lip set I am so excited to try this and then of course I decided to purchase her highlight as well this is really cool because they basically combine two of our favorite highlights I'm so worried about this you guys because it's like a baby pink and a gold and I was like oh my god this is gonna be like way too light for my skin tone but I wanted to support my friend so if you guys are planning any collabs know that I will be there to support you um, because we need to you know show brands like if you collab with non problematic youtubers we will support them so okay I don't even know it's like what are the two colors she combined ah sorry I'm a hot mess okay does it say does it say I think it was like shoot where is my phone let me see if she mentioned it okay so it's pillow talk and star island I think star island is the pink shade so let me just Oh my god, these are really freaking icy, you guys. So there are the swatches on my skin tone. And I'm pretty tan right now, just so you guys know, because it's summertime and I've been outside quite a bit. So anyway, I also got these uh, sweet USA sunnies, so that's handy. But let me swatch these quick. I really want to wear this. Okay, let's just do the nude one first. This is called... Manila and she said this is just like her favorite nude to wear and let's see here My lips are like crusty yet. I'm not worried about it Ooh, This feels nice it does have a subtle scent doesn't bother me At all. Uh oh, I just overlined <laughs> mm, These are creamy don't mind this right here I made a mess already okay so this is the shade Manila I like it I could actually see myself wearing this it's a little lighter than I'm used to but oh my god and it's so hydrating feeling like and this is a liquid lipstick not bad at all okay and then let's try the dark shade this one is called Pasadena. This looks like a perfect shade for me. It's like a mauve purpley shade. Oh yeah. These are like so neutral. I could definitely see myself wearing these like to work every day. Um, and they're so comfortable and they smell a little bit like sunscreen or sunblock. It has like a coconut smell. I don't know if that's just me. But I really like this color too. I could totally see myself wearing this. Super cute. Okay, now I want to try this one, which looks like my favorite. Uh, Las Olas. Oh my god, I love terracotta nudes. 
Ooh, I like this color a lot. Now I can finally check Ofra Liquid Lipsticks off my bucket list. So creamy. I've always wanted to try these. So I'm so glad they collabed with Samantha March so I could support her. And yeah, I'm glad she picked like some really wearable everyday colors. So if you've been like wondering like, are these gonna be too light? Are they gonna work with a deeper skin tone? Um, obviously I'm not a deeper skin tone, but for my medium complexion, I think all of these shades are so wearable and so worth it because you're not getting like blues and stuff, you know? It's very Samantha March, I would say. And now it's time to try the highlighter. I'm just gonna go in with this Pro Fan Detail Brush from Sephora. I think I'm gonna try the gold shade. I'm scared to try the pink on my face. Oh my gosh. I do have a little bit of highlight from this morning. Um, I just like put on a little bit of the Milk Highlighter Stick thing that I have. Um, but it's pretty much gone, so. I've always heard how blinding over highlighters are. I have one over highlight. I got one in a boxy charm once. Um, but this is like my first ever like Ofra like purchase um, and experience. Okay, I'm gonna try Star Island, I think this one is called, on this cheek. Pink highlighters definitely freak me out. I think also, doesn't Angelica love Ofra highlighters? I feel like she does. Maybe she'll be the next Ofra collab. <laughs> but okay, there's the pink one. And then this is um, Pillow Talk, I believe, on this side. And then Hollywood something on um, this side. Oh my god, you can really like build these up. That's pretty blinding. Let me try and mix them and put some on my nose and on my chin. I feel very glowy currently. Current status glowing to the gods. So yeah, this is my little demo video for you guys on the Samantha X Ofra collab. Let me know if you guys are planning on picking up any of these products. Let me know if you already did, what your thoughts are. If you have any other product recommendations on things you think I should try from Ofra, I would love to hear your thoughts. Thank you for watching this video and I will catch you in my next one soon. Bye guys.